And now Clark running the fast break. Gets it to K. Martin. Another layup falls. Clark, the rebound, the run out. Looking for Martin, got her filling a lane, and that's another missed layup in transition. And then Eck had it knocked loose. The breakout for Martin. Good jump stop for the finish. Back to Clark. Martin, baseline, scoop, count it. Totally capable of Panthers one out of their last five shots from the floor. The Hawkeyes haven't scored in now. Open look. Martin. Two fouls that have been getting a lot of bench time as well. Under a minute to go. The feed and the finish. Last year has three. And she's only played ten minutes. And I'm not sure if she's... That doesn't go for Briley Black. Clark up ahead to Martin. 0 for 8 as a team. Clark threading the needle, and right there is Kate Martin for the easy finish. Coach Shamil told us there would be different looks, different schemes defensively, but this time it was pretty floater from Lexi Fleming. But that allows Kate Martin to sprint down the court for two. We talk about football comparison. No hit for Brown. Clark tears it away. Martin already into double digits. And it locker room for Drake. Uh, didn't get back on Kate Martin. And from Ames, you got to think that that meant a lot to her beating Iowa State the other night. That are needing to step up. And she said, Kate Martin, can she do it again? Kate Martin. Wednesday, and there were a handful of players who, as there's a good cut for Mark Clark at 29, as, as Debbie said, just trying to break 30 to add another one of those games to her ledger. Ends with FGCU. Clark feeds down low and an easy. Just has... Two hands on her great back door. There's a nice streaker. And again. There it is. Martin open for on rebounds. Florida Gulf Coast has zero offensive rebounds. Five to shoot. Bounce pass. Martin. And going to be called for a travel. That's Martin for three. She got it. Clark sizing up Sanchez. Into the corner. The three is good. Edge from their loss earlier in the month. Clark gives it up. Wide open look. No good. Here's Clark. Clark gives it up. Martin's three. She got 22-21 lead. Clark didn't take the three. Martin will. And Caitlin Clark has never won in this building. Something she brought up right away to us today. Great backdoor look. Clark. Door passes. I that do. was a little bit easier. Look at that. Beautiful pass to the cutting. Bristow. Rebound banged into the arms of Clark. Clark in transition. Always dangerous. Finds the cutter. It's Martin. Clark races in, dumps underneath, beautifully done, and Martin lays it home. Clark is always going to demand attention, and there, three defenders looking straight at her. The game, guarding Porter, the Hawkeyes have a five on four as Porter is slow to pick up. Martin from deep. Back to back, give and go baskets. And then Martin gets silenced this crowd. Leaking out ahead is Martin. Clark. Another Hawkeye steal, and Clark whipping it to Martin, and one. Dumps inside for Clark. Kick out to Martin, pulls up from three, drains it. 41-37 to 37 on the fourth-ranked Iowa Hawkeyes. Caitlin Clark, pass inside for Martin off the glass, and good. Going to take one of the last couple of shots. Pass for Kate Martin, wide open, three, bingo! points for sure and that whole possession was really physical look for that to be look for that to be a story here find a way to limit that shot clock get it get it into single digits because you don't want you don't want Loyola getting those quick early for Loyola Chicago when it comes Keiko this was a quick shot by it's by Stokey just made that a difficult shot look at Kate Martin run the floor and that's because they've been very deliberate at getting into the paint that was the game plan they have executed it well Martin off. Big defensive play by a falter. Sets up the Iowa offense. Nice! Pass from Clark! That's what they do! Wow! 
Sticks point game. It's in the hands of Clark. Down to four. Going to work. Into the lane. Open Martin. That's a triple. And there's the horn. Ball game as they did in 40 on Tuesday. Martin. Nice footwork. Oh. Just leading the game. What a find. Holy cow. Right on cue. Transition on the move. I mean, boom. Leading Kate Martin to the basket. She doesn't even have to break stride. Players that have that experience at a high level that have won games and that know what it's like to compete for the longevity. Got it back. Kicks it out. Martin for three. The foul and almost gave up her fourth. Nobody picked up Kate Martin in transition. They just waste no time getting the ball up ahead even if they don't immediately get into a shot. So back Buckets by Kate Martin, and that possession was saved by Davis. Martin off guard a little bit. I was used to seeing a lot of different defenses, and that is exactly what Katie Gerald didn't want to happen tonight. And here is that last play, Caitlin Clark. You have, you have to pick her up early. You have to get a hand in her face. The 21 point, 13 rebound game in their last against Penn State. Cross court. That was good. Martin, Euro, and in. Here comes Caitlin. She loves transition. Martin rejects the screen. Martin. Minor in that top five. That was 2012, so Clark was, what, 10 years old? I know her birthday is tomorrow. Less than 10 on the shot clock. Martin draws contact. Away. She pitches it to Marshall. Martin, this would be a big shot. Iowa has to get to it quickly. Caitlin trying to go to her left. They give her the drive. Kate Martin. Natalie Potts, one of 16 from three in Big Ten play. This is what makes Iowa so dangerous. Wide open, the big sin in this game. And Clark pushing ahead. This is what Iowa can since 2022. Yeah, pretty remarkable. And, and you can tell that they are focused and fired up off that loss on the road to Ohio State. Mark, well, both Markowski and Stolke went to the floor hard on that play. Flower rightfully will pass to her teammate Mark. He has Shelly on her, one of the best defenders in the Big Ten, and she's bottled up. But Kate Martin bails her out her all-time scoring record. I know Dr. Christine Grant would be so proud of Beth Getz, and she would want people to know. Outscoring the Hawkeyes here in the fourth quarter, trying to keep it within striking distance. Mark Clark drops it off. Kate Martin wants to do. Aggressive defense to start. Second quarter. Kayla Clark has never won here in Maryland. Meanwhile, a nice dive. Guarded by Briggs. Clark, bounce pass, nice backdoor cut, Martin. Kate Martin recognizes it, perfect timing. 61, Clark drives, feeds, Martin, nice look, and great finish. Clark and Kate Martin just have this synergy. They understand where one another are going to be. Clark draws two, nobody helps over or drops into game. More pressure, Clark draws a double. Martin inside, and one. Clark, guarded by Briggs. Back door, finds Martin. Easy. You can see the pace of this game is back and forth. Martin draws the foul. Clark pushing. Finds Martin for three. The transition look is good. Other players limiting them. She said Sydney Falter, a player who came in and hurt us last game. Kate Martin is so good off the ball. Almost surprised that she could do that, but Caitlin Clark told her I expect. And rescued by Caitlin Clark. Iowa so good running the floor and a miss right at the rim. Clark on the drive and kick. Martin fired into the lane. She traveled. Clark fires it down low, and that's number 1,000 in the assist column, and an absolute rocket off her hand. In her way, looking for teammates on the kick. She found Martin, and that is the date. Caitlin Clark. 
for Martin. For the young woman with the basketball. Gets it to Martin somehow. And we've got goals here. We want to win this basketball game. How about 23 first quarter points? I mean, are you Sports kidding me? Peyton Clark now has 40. Somehow got it to Kate Martin, who finishes. So strong. She's tough. Makes little plays, but comes across here. Stays somehow shoulder square to the basket, and she's able to get that shot off. Off balance, momentum falling backwards. Gotta get into the weight room to make that kind of shot. Keep Martin. Zazz on her passes. You know that one hurt. Martin feeling it. Oh, but he starts with the defense. Brian you. Martin, Hawkeye's on the run. To a cutting Kate Martin. Getting three looks that time with the midi. Nice finds. And Kate Martin to get more involved in the offense. There's Martin Clark trying to find some space. Martin right underneath the... Over 50% in transition. Nothing comes out of that possession for Illinois. Kate Martin wide open. Scrambling to try to find shooters. Kate Martin somehow sneaks underneath the defense to pull the trigger. Nice pass inside her best. The last time... She's already got 15 and counting now. Kicking it. Corner three on the way. Good when they don't have their best effort games. Kate Martin. Leaves the That's 12 points right now. And she can score at all three levels. Inside Kate Martin from Clark. Off Valley Powers in the Big Ten Conference and in college basketball. Brock's coughing up again. Here comes Caitlin. Martin steps into a J. Clark back door, nice look, Martin, easy layup. Clark.